When Lena ran out of the skeletal parts, the body was 80% complete. She didn't have the skills to make any assumptions about the specimen or who had inhabited it, but she guessed there would be a skull somewhere. She walked back into the corner where she had found the bones. Deep in the corner, a rock sat sinking into the ground. Lena approached it, squatted, and pushed as hard as she could. The rock edged away. The soil below was cooler and finer than the rest of the garden. She dipped her hand in and immediately felt the solidness of the skull. Wrenched in every direction, pulling and jiggling, she freed it. A human head, somebody's face, a brain, eyes, senses, and scents. Holding it high, she went back to, to the back driveway and placed it at the top of her incomplete body, then aligned the other bones as neatly as she could. She turned toward the house and found her mother standing behind her, quiet, solid, Mom, look what I found, Lena pointed to her display. Some of the soldiers from the right, I'll bet. Or maybe some of the Syrians. No, Lena. Her mother's voice was low and frightened, her body stiff. What's wrong? What? She grabbed her mother's arm. It was his fault, Lena. I was so angry.